Oh, tune in TV. Good morning, good evening, good afternoon. As you can see, it's like 7 a.m. man, and it's fucking thunderstorming right now. That that means if you do food delivery, rainy days equal more money, man. It's bright and early getting to this loop, but hey, I want to make this quick, quick, quick tune update. You know what I mean? What we call it? Uh, tune time. Yeah, 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 yeah. I, I forgot all about my own little saying. I'ma tell you about this story, man. I'm gonna tell y'all this real quick story about how this guy was driving Lyft. And he finessed the system, man. If you ever did Lyft or you ever did Uber, right? Uh, y'all ever had hospital trips? Like you ever had to pick somebody up from the hospital? Well, I did. Hey, yo, so remember, this is not me. This story I'm explaining, this ain't got shit to do with me. I just know the story. I'm not trying to get in trouble for somebody else's fault. P.S. This is not me. <laughs> he was telling me he picked this person up um, at the hospital. Now, the person was only going like two, three miles. So if you ever did Uber and Live, you know that if you pick somebody up from here and y'all go like right over there, you only gonna get paid like $5. So he dropped the person off, wasn't thinking nothing of it, right? He driving around, driving around, was like, oh shit, I forgot to mark it as delivered, or, or I, I don't know if it's delivered or it's um, like, you know, complete the order. So by the time he completed the order, um, he got paid like $30, $40, right? So he was like, yo, Tune, how the fuck did I get paid that? I'm like, I don't know. He gets another trip from the same hospital, y'all. No kidding, no lie. Not thinking nothing of it again. Talking to the part, you know how you just, if you ever did Uber and Lyft, you know some people you actually connect with, they in the back, y'all chopping it up, having a good time. He dropped the person off, not thinking of it again, just took off, driving around, woo woo woo. So by the time he finally decides to mark it as complete, you know, he forgot to, he got paid like 70 something dollars. So he was like, yo, is this a new hack or something? He told me the next day, I'ma try this little experiment out. I'm gonna go to the hospital, see if I get a trip from somebody and see, you know, see if it's like that. So the third person he picked up, she was like, yeah, my Medicaid, my Medicare, whatever covers the trip, woo, woo, woo. So he's telling me, he's like, yo, I feel a little bit better because I feel like I'm taking from the customer by doing this. But when this person told me that Medicaid is basically covering the hospital cover and I don't know, uh, he didn't feel so bad. So he dropped this person off, he purposely now, I don't know what Lyft is doing this year or Uber, but three, four years ago, you used to could change the designation in the app. So if you got a passenger in the back, right? And they say, oh shoot, I really need to go over here. You can actually change it and they don't have to do it on, on their end, right? So he dropped the person off. He'll change the address. He went to like the airport, right? Somewhere that's like 30, 40 minutes away. He said, I done found the new hack, bro. Bro, I'm talking about for four months straight, Four months straight, I'm, word to my mother, four months straight, August, September, October, November, somewhere in between me and November, I don't know if they caught on. He didn't get deactivated, let's put that out there. To this day, he's still active on Lyft. Yo, so he was like, yo bro, every day, I would get up, say Monday morning, I would go to the hospital by eight to nine o'clock in the morning pick up my first person nine times out of ten that person is through medicaid and they just going home so like he found the whole finesse system pick that person up take them to their house because nine times out of ten medicaid was only paying for like five miles tops you know what i'm saying so he would drop them up change the address go to the airport when you get to the airport change it again from the airport to downtown so the distance between downtown and the airport in the city that he was in was probably about 35 40 minutes well about 30 minutes right so he would go airport downtown airport downtown airport market as complete get paid like 70 80 dollars for that drop it off well you know click complete he would literally go back to the same hospital Hit another person and do the same thing. Down, back, down, back, down, back. By the time he completed another $70, $80. I'm, when I, listen, when he told me this, again, this is not me. When he told me this, I was like, yo, you were bugging. This dude was bringing home like 500 a day. 
Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, Friday. Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, every day for four months straight. Now, I don't, they, they must have caught on, to be honest with you. They would have to have caught on. And dude have found a little hack. So what he would do every day, he would get up at nine, go to the hospital, get a pin. It was like clockwork, like every day, bro. Go to the hospital, pick somebody up, do a down back, down back, like literally airport, downtown, airport, downtown. Mark complete, get paid like $80 for it. Drive right there to the hospital because it was nothing but like a mile from the downtown area. Pick somebody else up, do a down back, down back. I'm talking about every day, boy. Bringing home like $400 by four o'clock every day and still do Uber Lyft in the afternoon. Now, again, I guess it's, I told him, I said, bro, that's fraud. That is fraud, yo. But at the same time, man, look, bro, this is billion dollar companies, man. They ain't helping the drivers out. They ain't paying for our cars. They're not doing nothing. All they doing is pairing people to people and they taking their percentage. So, nigga, get your money, bro. I don't advise y'all to do that. Uh, you know, I was really hesitant about explaining this little quick little story, but uh, fuck it. Nigga, I'm not doing it. I didn't do it. So shit, hey, if the next person want to try to make some more money, man, try it. Just try it. Wait, wait, wait. I wouldn't suggest you do it to a regular customer. I would prefer, if you're going to do it, which I think and feel that you should not do it, but if you're going to do it because you're grown and I can't tell you what to do, uh, do the hospital. Ask the person when they get in the car, hey, is Medicaid, uh, is the hospital covering this trip? If they say yeah, nigga, run that shit up, man. Get that money, bro. Did they making millions of dollars a day off of, off of you and the customer? So, you know what? Fuck it. That's just my little quick little tune time, man. I just wanted to give y'all a little quick update. Uh, I know you're probably wondering, well, is he still on the apps? Yeah. They, did, they didn't boot him out. And it's been like, what, three, four years. So, uh, by them not booting him out, and he's still active, I guess nothing happened. That's what I'm saying. He, at first, when he was telling me this, he was scared to do it. But he was like, you know what? Man, these insurance companies, man, these hospitals make millions of dollars, bro. They not gonna miss out on no $20. They ain't gonna see that $20. Now, nah, this was about 2019. And they didn't catch on. And the nigga still, I ain't saying he doing that no more, but he's still on the app. So, yeah, he, he ran up a, a, a pretty big bag on Lyft, bro. Uh, it is what it is, man. Don't do it. <laughs> Cause your ass could get in trouble. So I'm not advising you to do it, man. So I love y'all, appreciate y'all. Make sure you like, subscribe, comment, stay tattooed. It's cold as fuck outside. I just wanted to make a quick up. Uh, I just wanted to make a quick outside video real quick, man. Uh, we gonna head back and get back to work, man, because I'm wasting time. But uh, I want to tell y'all that little update, man. Tune in TV.